Hello guys and girls, Foxy Raven TV here with, well, this is not really a gameplay video, but we're gonna look at uh, the first Ascendant here because it's launching today. Oh yes, it's launching in a couple of hours. And uh, yeah, I'm sorry for the time um, that I upload this video here, but it had to be done in my opinion. So we're gonna look at all of the characters here. So we have the, we have L Lipic, Ajax, Viesa, Jaybar, Sharon, Glay, Blair, Bunny, Freyna, oh yeah, Freyna, Valby, Guile, Yesmo, and Enzo, and Yurin. Um, at, at least I think that's what she call, she's called. Then we have the the ultimate characters here, so it's just a, a buffed up version of, uh, of Lepic, Vesa, Ajax, Bunny, and Clay. But yeah, let's look at uh, at the at Lepic here. So Lepic is a DPS role. Uh, a dealer who uses grenades to attack, clear the battlefield with his tactical prosthetic arm, whatever, his robot arm, <laughs> and grenades, which boost, uh, boast a powerful performance. Okay. And then we can see his attributes here. It's fire. Okay. Down here, passive skill, close call, okay, and then the grenade, it's tech, throw grenade, forward, yeah, sure, uh, overclock, singularity, s s singular, okay, uh, so it's single thing, increase attack, okay, oh, okay, I see, so you buff this up here before you throw grenades and so on, yeah, okay, and tactical grenades, throw grenade, uh, a traction. Oh, traction. My bad. Traction grenade forward to pull in enemies. Oh, so yeah, it's like... Yeah, that's nice. I like that. Overkill. Fires a powerful shell at the enemy. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Yeah. So I'm just gonna, gonna link this here um, to the characters here in the video description so you can you can read all of this yourself if you want to. I'm just gonna, gonna look... Uh, and what roles and so on they are. So Ajax is a tank. Yeah, that's freaking nice. And he also have these this shield here, uh, frontal shield, the orbit barrier. Then he can uh, do a, a volt walk. Uh, so he leaps into the air, smashing the ground. I think you can see a, a small clip up here uh, with his abilities. Uh, that's freaking nice. He's leaping now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Boom. That's nice. Uh, but yeah, this one here is is like a dome of, uh, of 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 shield as well. And it's getting stronger the more HP and defense Ajax has. This might actually be my starting class, uh, not gonna lie. It it will make a lot uh, I mean things a lot easier to start with. Then we have Viesa and her attributes is chill, so freeze, froze, frozen or whatever, and she is gorgeous. Holy smoke! There we have the uh, the ice spears here, a really good passive as I remember. The uh, frost shots were great as well, and uh, yeah, so so these abilities right here, right, are not actually the only abilities for this character here. When you kill bosses. And, uh, and so on, tougher enemies, they have a chance to spawn some modules for you that will actually alter your abilities. So this ice shot ability here might be, I mean, the first shot here, fires an explosive ice beam, right? Uh, and ice shaggle around the area it, hi it hits. This might actually become a blizzard instead. This one might, might actually become something totally different as well. The same with this one here. And uh, yeah, this is Blizzard, of course, but the, the point being is they will alter your abilities if, when you equip those modules. So uh, yeah, it's not only these uh, skills here. Uh, she has she has many more, and it counts for all of the characters here. Oh, what was she? Was she a DPS? Man. Debuffer. Oh, she's a debuffer. Okay, see. Cool, cool, cool. Debuffer is... Ulti... 
utility dealer. I don't know what that is though. And there are his uh, attributes are non attributes. Okay. So passive turret sunk. Oh, there you go, guys and girls. S someone actually asked me about is that a turret guy or girl in the game? Yeah, it seems like it. So turret sink. Yeah. There you go. Assault turret. Medical turret. Oh. Multi purpose gun. Huh. Reactivate. Recall all summon turret. Black powerful damage to nearby enemies after using total recall. Oh my lord. Okay. This might actually be my new favorite character. <laughs> yeah. I like I like turrets. I like them turrets. Okay, so we have Sharon here and a close range dealer. Close range dealer, okay. Electric. Okay, so she's like a bunny. Uh I think bunny is electric as well. Assassinator. She seems cool as well. Holy smoke. Cut off beam. Oh, yeah. <coughs> Active camouflage. Oh, she's an assassin. Yes, you are. That might not be handy in PvE, but I might be wrong, though. Impact rounds. Not just a built in explosive forward. Okay, seems cool. Fusion. Target enemies with range. Ooh, yes. Multiple throwable knives. And again, these abilities here are just the starting abilities. You might you might actually get the, uh, as I said before, a module from a boss that will totally alter your abilities for on your fire characters. So, uh, yeah. Another utility dealer. <laughs> Not attributes, clay, and uh, she's 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 a medic, I suppose. Yeah, she's a medic. She has like uh, two per personalities, so she's switching back and forth from. So uh, yeah, as you, you can see here, her, her hair, hair turned into into a blonde blonde hair from from a from a brown brownette to a blondine, as we <laughs> say. Uh, yeah. Consume HP to enter Berserk mode. Yeah, I think that that's what what she she does when uh, she her head turns into uh, into a blonde. Life Sibern. Yeah, she seems good as well. Holy smoke! Yeah. Oh Blair. Oh Blair. Dud dealer. So damage over time dealer. It's it's funny that. They have so many different role roles here. So normally this one would just be a DPS, right? But but it's damage over time dealer. That's that's insane. Um, oh, I like damage over time. Not gonna lie. Um, yeah, I actually I actually I actually think that player is amazing in the first ascendant because there's so many enemies at, at times. So dealing damage over time to them, it it some in some games it just feels right, right? And the and the first ascendant t damage over time just feels right. I mean, yeah, that's why I love Freyna as well. But his attribute is fire, of course, passive, pitmaster. Then we have the blaze up, the extinguis, and burn taste, deadly cuisine. Yeah, he's nice. A roll nuger. <laughs> so bunny is a nuger. Okay. Yeah. Attribute electric. Passive rabbit foot. Thrill bomb. Light speeding. So yeah, I actually remember getting uh, some modules for uh, for the bunny here. That altered some of her abilities. I just can't remember what to to what. But yeah, I, I got a few modules from the bosses in the in the cross crossplay beta in 2023. So, uh, yeah. And then my favorite character, Freyna. Yeah, she's a, she's a dot dealer as well, as I said. It just feels right in a game like this. Uh, and she's freaking amazing. I love her. Absolutely my favorite character in the uh, in the betas. 
absolutely just freaking amazing. Yeah, Toxic just feels right as well. Uh, so yeah, Toxic Trauma, oof, yeah. Uh, yeah, she, 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 she's just, just good. She is disgusting good. Um, Walby. Constant DPS. Okay, so so constant damage per second. How 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 does that even work? Constant damage per second. DPS stands for damage per seconds. So she's stealing constant damage per second. What? <laughs> okay. She she she's OP, I guess. Um. When using skill while standing on water, she consumes less mana. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Laundry? Okay. Laundry bomb? Sure. She's not my favorite. She she looks like a like a, like a spoiled brat. I don't know why, but she does. People think she's hot. I, I mean, I, to me, she she looks like a child. Nasty. Uh, Kyle, Bruiser, a damage dealing tank. A damage dealing tank. So, so, so a Bruiser is a damage dealing tank. I mean, with all these roles here, I expect we get a frick of a ton other characters later on in the game. And I'd, they actually said that we're getting a, I mean, a ton, a ton, just in the first half year. Yeah, we're getting a ton of new characters as well. That's amazing, in my opinion. Yeah, he he seems he's yeah he, he's a he's a semi tank, I suppose. <laughs> yes, Mo. Is is he Mo? Whatever. This name. <laughs> Burst DPS. Okay, and our attributes fire. They like fire for sure. Passive skill. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna gonna even try to uh, to pronounce this. Time bomb, yeah. Blast. Guided landmine. What? That seems nice. Arc explosion. Oof. Okay, 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 okay. Enzo. Enzo. Non attribute. Roll support. Shoot support. Start supply. Okay. Yeah, explosive drone. Oof. Oof, 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 oof. Enhanced combat shoot. So a support character, ha, huh. ha, 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 Yeah, that might be good as well. I like, I like support characters. I really do. A support who uses supply drones. Command the battlefield by supplying ammo to allies. Okay, yeah, that's, that's useful. That is freaking useful. Holy smoke. While launching long range attack with drones at the same time. So yeah. Not only is he supplying allies with ammo so they can continue to fire their special weapons, but he's also firing long-range attack with drones at the same time. So staying at longer range with something like a sniper or whatever, and also the drones, while supporting your closer-range allies with ammo. Oh, yes. Oh yes, I like that. I like that a lot. Yorian, Yorian, Yorin. It sounds like like urine. <laughs> pee pee. <laughs> yeah, support. <laughs> Sorry, uh, support character. Yeah, non attributes. So she has drones as well. It seems like uh, stop over. Does it says over over re reacting? Yeah, it does. What the frick? Okay, let's read a healer support who uses his. What? Okay, whatever. Uh, select uh, drones to heal allies. He he, it's a guy. I did not s see that coming. Okay, he heals allies. And grants them beneficial buffs after determining um, the distance between the allies and him. What? I I don't understand this last part though. Determining 
the distance between the allies and him. But what does that that have to do with anything? Okay, whatever, I suppose. Solitaire healing. Yeah, I don't think I don't think this one will be useful. I'm not gonna lie. I, I, I just don't I just don't see that you need this much healing. I just I just don't I don't I don't see this one being a good good character. Might be wrong, but I but I can't I can't see it. I just can't. Then we have the ultimates here. Uh and to be honest, I don't care about these. I really don't. I, I, is it like a two or or, or three percent increase uh, in stats? That's it. Uh, but yeah, if it was anything more, then it would be too powerful, I suppose. But uh, they they look nice. The bunny looks nicer. Yeah, ooh, she is looking. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> Yes, I got more cloth on though. Bunny got less. The clay, yeah, 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 yeah. That's that's cool as well. That is freaking cool. I like that helmet a lot. Holy smoke! Reminds me a little about uh, Loki, right? With the helmet here. I don't know why, but it does. But yeah, there you go, guys and girls. Uh, and, and again, I will link the video in the description here. And uh, yeah, it's uh, it's nighttime in Denmark. I just woke up. I want to play this game on release. So uh, right now I have to wait around seven hours for the game to release. But uh, yeah, anywho, take care. And I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.